everyone it's rahul from technoria and today we are going to tell you how can you use a 3g modem or you can say 3g data card or dongle with your device so that in this case you will be using the internet connection from your 3g data card or you can say dongle on your device on your smartphone so today i am going to teach you how can you use the internet connection from this data card or you can say 3g modem to your Android smartphone. So you need couple of things. First of all, you obviously need a data card, which has a SIM inside it. As I have a SIM inside it, then you need this uh, USB OTG cable, and then you obviously need a Android smartphone, which has root access. Do consider this. You need to have a root access on your device to use this trick. So. First of all, just head into your Play Store and download the and free app which is PPP Wizard 2. You don't need to download PPP Wizard. It you have to download PPP Wizard 2 app. And once you download and install this app, you are ready to go. So first of all, let me just create a shortcut of that app to my home screen. It should be there. Yes. okay so now what I need to do is let me just connect my so as you can see currently it's showing no modem found but uh, it should detect our device so I have connected my modem via a USB OTG to this and it should detect yes it has detected as you can see all you need to do is just tap on ok and it's saying preparing device let me turn off my Wi-Fi ok now again tap on ok now you need to enter some details of your your sim card so let me just name my profile as okay now you need to know the APN address of your sim card you can ask this from your ISP so I in this point I know my APN so let it delete the password uh, so username and password as well now just go back and tap on connect it says building network so okay now again tap on okay and just allow it now you have connected to the internet via this data card and to show you let me open a web page so as you can see it's working so this is all it so all you need to have is the access to data card and usb otg cable and and free wizard or you can say app which you need to install and once you have these kind of thing you are ready to go so that is all for this video. If you have any question regarding this guide or any other device, do comment below. We will be happy to answer you. And don't forget to press the thumbs up for us if you like this video. And do subscribe to our video channel by pressing a subscribe button below. So thank you guys. Thanks for watching. This is your host Rahul signing off. And like always, have a nice day ahead.